Tonight, we are learning more about the man who shot and killed four Marines in Chattanooga, Tennessee. Counterterrorism investigators are examining the online activities of 24 year old Mohammed Youssef Abdulaziz, including two blog posts written just three days ago. The FBI is also taking a look at Abdulaziz's travel history. He reportedly spent several months in Jordan and Kuwait last year. All this as Chattanooga pays tribute to the Marines. CBS 2's Dana Tyler reports. As strangers, neighbors, and friends paused to reflect on their loss, flowers and flags expanded at a growing memorial. Ashley Miller brought her five year old son Blake in his Marine dress uniform to salute the fallen. His father is a lieutenant in the uh, Marine Corps. I just wanted to come down and have him pay his respects and my respects as well. Throughout the day, the names of the Marines slowly emerged. Some who had fought in wars abroad, ambushed here in Chattanooga. 40 year old Gunnery Sergeant Thomas Sullivan of Hampton, Massachusetts, a Purple Heart recipient and a veteran of two tours in Iraq. 21 year old Lance Corporal Skip Wells of Cobb County, Georgia, had joined the Corps just two years ago. 35 year old Staff Sergeant David Wyatt lived in nearby Hickson, Tennessee, and left behind a wife and two children. And 25 Five year old Sergeant Carson Holmquist from Jacksonville, North Carolina, was married with a son and based overseas until a year ago. In a somber motorcade this afternoon, their bodies were removed from the scene. A fifth victim, 26 year old Navy Specialist Randall Smith, was shot three times and remains hospitalized in critical condition. Maurice? Dana, thank you.